Thank you, Mr. Chairman, and today is an exciting day. Once again, we have worked together on a bipartisan basis to develop the Biennial Water Resources Development Act, or WERDA, legislation that we're considering today. I want to thank you and both of our staffs for putting together a tailored bill that authorizes critical water resource studies and projects for the Civil Works Program of the U.S. Corps of, uh, Army Corps of Engineers. From navigation improvements to flood risk management to ecosystem restoration, the work of the Corps protects the lives and livelihoods of millions of Americans and facilitates commerce throughout this country and internationally. Since 2014, Congress has passed WERDA legislation every two years. So today we're taking the important step to keeping that 10-year streak alive through our bipartisan agreement to address our nation's water resources needs. I also want to recognize the leadership of the EPW Subcommittee on Transportation and Infrastructure, Chairman Mark Kelly and Ranking Member Kevin Kramer, for you and your staff's dedication to this legislation. Word of 24 reauthorize, or you know, authorizes many new feasibility studies and projects as well as modifications of existing projects. The bill avoids that one-size-fits-all solutions while maintaining important flexibility for the core in developing projects in, consult in consultation with non-federal partners. It contains directives for the core to com develop comprehensive implementation plans for this WERDA and, pr and prior WERDAs. This will enable the core to focus its energy and resources on fully implementing this WERDA and, private and prior WERDA provisions in order to better reflect the intent of Congress and ensure the agency continues to be responsive to water resources needs. With that table setting about how WERDA is important to all of us, I would like to take a moment to highlight some of the ways this bill will directly address the needs of my home state of West Virginia. Almost eight years ago, in June of 2016, West Virginia experienced flooding at historic levels leading to tragic deaths and devastation. Today's bill provides support for future projects identified by the core feasibility study for flood risk management in the Canal River Basin. This legislation also increases the ability of the core to carry out smaller projects, such as emergency stream bank and shoreline protections, ecosystem restoration, and debris and obstruction removal, which are critical to many areas in our state. Word of 24 directs the Corps to expedite feasibility studies for the Upper Guyandot and Canal River Basin, as well as to expedite projects in Milton and at the Bluestone Dam in Hinton. This bill supports drinking and wastewater projects across West Virginia and order, authorizes the Corps to restore rivers and streams impacted by acid mine drainage in West Virginia and in our neighboring states of Ohio and Pennsylvania. Increased partnership with West Virginia University, improved education and research outreach to communities and modernization of how the Corps assesses communities' ability to pay will improve the Corps' activities and outcomes in my state. I think every member on this committee could probably go through the litany of where we have worked with you, all the numerous projects that the chairman said were submitted to us, and I know you have a lot of uh, good successes in this bill for your home states as well. I urge my colleagues to support Word of 2024 and look forward to working to get our Word of Legislation uh, into law. As the, as the chairman mentioned, we're authorizing five other bills, and I'm pleased to report that um, the FEMA bill, the National Dam Safety Bill, the, and the FASTA bill, and, and also um, the naming of the courthouse uh, by Leader McConnell to name after Sixth Circuit, Sixth Circuit Senior Judge Eugene Seiler, Jr. Um, so, with that, I thank you for your teamwork and uh, on all six bills we're considering today, and I'm proud that we're going to be reporting them out under your leadership.